So they've gone out there, they've measured twice already. The guy that walked out there, I didn't see it go deeper than, than his knee. I got all my ropes ready, just in case somebody does get stuck crossing, that way I can give them a pull if they need to. Cheater rope, two freedom ropes. Got my hitch over there, soft shackles. These guys in that car must be with some sort of agency. He's wearing a jacket and they had backpacks. They just loaded back up. Oh, look, he didn't make it already. Ron's gonna make it. Ron's gonna show him how it's done right now. At this point, I drove down there to go give Ron a hand. Um, he coincidentally called me right as I got to the waterline. I told him I was on my way. Um, I pulled up to the front. I hooked up. There wasn't any hookup points on the front as far as hooks, so I hooked up with two soft shackles. On one side, I hooked up to a lower control arm because that's all I could see. And then I used my Freedom Ropes cheater rope. And on the other side, I was able to find some frame that I hooked up the soft shackle to. And then I had um, two one-inch 30-foot freedom ropes hooked up in series for 60 foot of rope. So at that point, we gave it a go, and it took a couple of pulls. We, I give, give him a pull at first while he was still hooked up to the rental truck, and um, no go. So then we disconnected the rope, his rope, from the rental truck, and then I pulled Ron out. Um, at that point, we were going to regroup, and we were going to hook up two ropes, each of us together, to the front of the rental truck. And the rental company had their own truck pull up at that point, so we decided to call that plan off. And right after that, the rangers came and told us that they were going to close the crossing. <laughs>
They're on the other side now. I see everybody else over there. Everyone's all lined up. That's where I was at. Truck did his job. Got Ron pulled out. Steve's ATV had their people. I had my uh, my two one-inch ropes. That's what I used to pull Ron out, and then I had my two 1.25s ready to go. But then they told us they're shutting it down. So that's that. There's a couple of dips out there for sure. Yeah. 